Hello, this is TLV with FTB Ultimate, where we try to progress and make a better system, more power. So I'm thinking, where do we want this lava generation from the lava that's available on the server? On this floor, where we have all the temporary chests, I think I want to do a 10 wide array of uh, geothermal generators. But then we have to clear out these chests here. Which I can, but um, we want, yeah, we want to clear out this chest actually ASAP here because it's only a temporary system. So uh, if we find material while we create the geothermal uh, machines, we can do that. So let's see, what do we need for geothermal machines? Geothermal. So we need generators. I'm thinking maybe we can start with uh, uh, 40 generators. That's 800 EU per tick. Let's see how well that goes. <laughs> Let's see how much resources it, it we will use as well. Oops, didn't mean to use up all that. So let's see how fast we can make 40 generators. 19 get some more cobble four stacks this is gonna require quite some resources I think but it will generate 400 800 EU per tick because that's uh, and one geothermal generator generates uh, I think it's uh, What is it? One geothermal generates uh, 20 EU per tick. So it should be fine. Let's take from this temporary chest here. Three stacks of iron. Let's get it in there. 25. 35. 38. Oh, we don't even have enough. Use up all the iron. 40. And now we turn these guys. No, we need 40 batteries. 40 batteries. We can do this. We can do this. Was it? I think it's like this. And tin on the side, right? Tin ingots. Let's get the silver in here. It should find their way. We just place it down here. Silver, silver, refined, cobble, should find its way somehow. Yeah, that's the way. We could make it, we could make one. Nice. So, three stacks of that shit, and then maybe some redstone. We'll cut it. To make 40 fucking batteries. Sixteen. Thirty-two. How much resources do we have left? Need two more. Ten. And while we cook up this recipe, we should use the time more wisely. We need liquiducts. Liquiducts. Liquiduct. That's hardened glass and iron copper. So in deduction smelter we need lead and pulverized obsidian. So let's smelt up some obsidian, shall we? Start with uh, one stack of wood. Let's see how fast we can do this. I think we can do this pretty fast. 32 obsidian. And we need copper. And a lead, I mean. Get two stacks of lead. There we go. So make room here. Or is there room? Oh, it's still running. Smelt the, that guy. Put in the 
prepare here. Induction furnace. I think we have some uh, pulverized obsidian ready. Yeah, we need much more pulverized obsidian here. Maybe even another stack of it. We'll see. We'll let that those 32 cook up while we continue with the batteries to make the geothermal generation. We need a lot of tin for this. Actually, more than I anticipated, maybe. But that should be fine. Should be fine. And I prepared some more barrels as well. Or international inter extra dimensional storage. So I think ten is a good number there. Give us some tin. What else do we need? Some more tin, 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 tin. You f you are a bit tinny. I think that's a Monty Python sketch. 32 plus 9. Oh, we made one more than we need. That's 41. That's okay. No harsh feelings. And then generators. So we need uh, quite a bit of... Um, uh, reinforced iron here. Twenty-five, fifteen, thirty-one. How are we with the iron there? Wow, forty generators, perfect. And geothermal, I think it's this way. Let's press U on this guy. See if that's quicker than writing it. Maybe it's not. Yeah, geothermal. Glass re reinforced and uh, tanks reinforced glass. So I did prepare a lot of glass somewhere. So I guess it's still downstairs. Let's fix these pulverized here. Twenty three. Make us some hardened glass, god damn it. We've got four, six. Oh, it's gonna cook up there. Perfect. Let's see here. Glass, yeah. Glass, glass, glass. Make a lot of power. I think we want it on the first floor actually. Because it will fit uh, rather nicely. Three stacks, please. More. More glass. One stack is not sufficient. That would give us only 16 geothermals. Need at least two more stacks. Well, I'm pretty sure they should be here. Two stacks, there we go. The stuff we prepared. Alright, there we go. Ready to make some lava power. Not just a little. Nineteen. How's it going? Thirty-two. I think we're out of um, empty cells. So let's use the tin we have on hand here. Take advantage of uh, this guy here, maybe. 64. Damn it. And actually, we have all the resources we need. Perfect. Some more reinforced iron. And we can do this. F 
40 to <laughs> Now we need some uh, glass fiber because of this. <laughs> oh, so the extra glass will come in handy actually. <laughs> Believe it or not. Alright. Wow. That's not even close to how much we need. Emergency situation. More... How are we good doing here? Nine and two more of these guys. Pulverized obsidian. Smelt some glass. And as well as making the ender tank. First time make an ender tank here. Obsidian cauldron, there's some iron. We can do it this, we can do this. Regular iron please. Cauldron. And also two We've got the wool already. There's one obsidian. <laughs> Did we put my, my obsidian in here, maybe? No, we didn't. Oh, we have to make some more obsidian. But we can do that quickly. Cauldron. Wool. Obsidian. Blaze rods. And the pearl, I think. And one more obsidian. Get a whole stack of it, why not? This is probably like the best recipe, almost, to get obsidian just from wood like that. It's slightly overpowered, they should nerf that, maybe. Because obsidian is like a pain in the ass to mine, seriously. Ender tank! Let's take 16 of that and make pulverize it as well. we're doing for the glass here 36 together with copper makes liquid ducts so should we do a 10 by 10 here then it will look pretty cool one two three four five six seven eight, five. wow let's do um start here let's get out the minium stone again Forty-four <laughs> liquid ducts. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> More than we need. Let's get them out here. Wow. Is this an overkill? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> One, two. Oh, I move too fast. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, perfect. Well, we should do one row at a time here. And then we do three of these guys. So one, two, three. And then one, two, three for the vacuum freezer. So there will be space. Hopefully. Damn. <laughs> Let's turn on the jetpack again. So are they connected now? Yep, that's the input. The input is the all glowing yellow, so that's good. This might look a bit ridiculous. <laughs> but our system is quite... Um, it 
think it's quite drained if you check the power here and how much UU it makes. Still not our first, my first uh, UU hasn't been made yet. Let's actually quickly, quickly turn on the frame quarry here and actually connect up the scrap production and see how much it drains. That's going to be fun. Sorry for interrupting in between there, but let's do this at the same time. It's going to be pretty funny. So let's move it into new position. Quickly. We can do this quickly. We're getting a lot of stuff done in this episode, actually. I'm really impressed. Let's just move it here in the new position. And it never runs out of power. It mines perfectly what we want it to mine. Only on two chunks. And 250 frames. So that's really good. So thanks to the border lines here, we can see that it's in position. Move it... Uh, yeah, it's backwards, of course. Backwards 8. There you go. There we go. A few more. Oops. Too far, right? For a three. Even one more. There we go. Okay. Let's start up that guy. So he's gonna go to the right. Okay. Right and backwards. Right and backwards. Do, 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 quickly! Hook up the system! So much done in this episode. Very productive episode here. FQ. Ho ho ho! Uh, depth 93. It's lagging a bit. <laughs> right. Distance 32. Backwards. 160. And because I know our that our quarry is 160 wide. So now we're gonna have input again. So let's uh, bring up this. Uh, let's connect up these guys again. See what happens. Need uh, another color here though. Because oh no 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 no. Didn't know you would be that fast. Quickly, another color. Um, we can do green there as well. On the bottom. Green. Uh, don't want them to connect to each other. Don't fuck around. <laughs> Okay. Oh, these guys are n not connected by redstone either. Um, um, jacketed wire, jacketed wire. Oh, we're not carrying any jacketed wire. Oh, man. Jacketed wire. I must have dropped it, I think. Oh, jacketed wire. I want to see how this works. If it works exactly like I wanted it to. We have j no jacketed wire to take from anywhere else either. Damn. Oh, there it is. Okay, let's get down there. Hook it up to the system. Green. Ah, they will go all the way around. Up there. No, they won't. 
Oh, the, because I have a fucking barrel here with. That's a fail. Um, okay. Uh, Temporary. Uh, <laughs> fail, 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 fail. Okay, what are you gonna do now, fucking. What are you gonna do about this? There you go! <laughs> now you found the, found the right place to go to. Let's see here. There's nowhere else to go, right? Exactly, so you choose, choose that path. This is exactly how we wanted this to work. Perfect, so how our power should be super drained now. We're making some scrap at least. I'm really happy about that. It works like a charm. Let's get rid of some more um, tin and shit here. Slag. Four stacks. And since it's added to the ender chest, we could just put it in like this. I forgot. Here. No, fuck, what did I click? No oh, fucking phone calls. What did we put in the system? Something wrong. <laughs> I put something in important in there, I think. It probably went here instantly. Not that important, I guess. <laughs> Okay, so uh, we'll hook up the, this power in the next episode and see where it leads us, how much power generation. Okay, we're almost finished with this. So bye for now, bye bye.